Kent State baseball coach Greg Dennis notched his 1000th career win yesterday. Dennis has been winning ever since his high school days at Notre Dame, where he captured a state championship. 1,000 career wins. Yeah, kind of hard to believe for Greg Dennis. It kind of boggles my mind a little bit because 1,000, it, when you stop thinking about it, it, it that's stacking up a, a lot of ball games, much less a lot of wins. Even Dennis's first paycheck as a baseball coach at McLennan Community College boggled his mind. I think I was, it was like $23,000, and it was, a, it, was a, it was a mint to me. It was, I, I, you know, having, that was really my first full-time job, and uh, I taught six classes. Ball down, we're going. Now Dennis simply enjoys teaching the game of baseball. Uh, there's plenty of times when I think, man, maybe it's time to start thinking about doing something else. But I just know how badly I would miss and, I, and how much I love. I just love the sport. And I think baseball is a game built around failure, and you just have to get up and dust yourself off and get back out there. And as a coach, I think well, we do the same thing a lot. In college one year at Florida State, Dennis faced Bo Jackson. But I was playing third, and Coach Martin kept telling me, move up, move up, move. And, and, and I was like, that guy's really, really big in year one because he was afraid he was going to bunt. And I, I told Coach Martin afterwards, I said, look, I'll do whatever you want me to do, but please, let's just go ahead and play that guy to swing, not to bunt. I played against Kirby Puckett in his last college game. We beat him in the Grand Junction in the JUCO World Series. I got the game-winning hit in extra innings, and after that game, he signed with the Twins. Do you feel like an institution now here at Chattanooga? State? No, I feel like I probably ought to be in an institution, to be honest with you, <laughs> institutionalized. No, I'm just a guy that loves where he's at and, and loves this community and wants to uh, to hopefully spread the gospel of baseball and also uh, uh, make hopefully better men.